All right. So as you can see, y'all are in my loader. This is a uh, brand new job, still in Monroe County, Mississippi. Let's see, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna put this one in the pole pile. It's a little top. It's got a little bit of a bow to it, but it'll, I believe it'll make a pole. So with this being a new job, that means that we did finish the other job, or they did. I think they finished it uh, Saturday. Finished the job Saturday and moved past Saturday got everything moved over here did not work Monday uh, because of the uh, rain that we got Sunday we had a uh, great deal of rain on Sunday and it uh, we're a pretty good little piece in here on this job not quite as far in as we was on the other one but yeah we we're back in here in the road the Woods Road is it's, it's so so. That's one thing that we don't have the uh, at our disposal availability. Quick, fast around here is rock like uh, crushed limestone number fifty-seven, two and three inch stuff. If uh, we have to have it, it has to be trucked in from roughly seventy-five eighty sometimes over 100 miles depends on what uh, pit they get it from what quarry that it comes from but it's a lot of our uh, woods roads are still clay if you rock them it costs an uh, incredible amount of money that somebody's got to pay for them uh, with us cutting for a uh, timber company they're the ones that usually pay for that and uh, you know sometimes they they're just like everybody else they don't want to they don't want to pay for it, don't want to have to put the money out there, but so you just kind of have to make do sometimes and you'll miss days and yesterday happened to be one of those days that we missed because it was too wet. So you got to let it sit for a little bit, but loading some pine, these are some uh, saw logs, they'll make dimensional lumber out of these logs here. y'all ride along. So I'm 
gonna get fired back in tomorrow, which will be Wednesday, and go back to doing tree work. I took off a couple of weeks and didn't do any. Well, I did do a couple of little small jobs. I didn't film them or anything, but I'm gonna uh, get back after tomorrow. I got quite a few jobs. I've been sitting on several jobs that I have done. I picked up some. Uh, early week this week and over the weekend. So I'm gonna get after it on them. I've got several several film that I have not edited up, published yet. I mean I got some to go all the way back to October I had to publish. international paper printer somebody asked about the printers and putting printers in the truck and that the signal won't ain't gonna work anyway it won't pick up inside the trucks Plus, these printers are nearly a thousand dollars a piece, too. So, you got that going on. This one here, there you go. I don't know if it's going to print right or not. Let's see. Yeah, she printed it right. And we were late starting out this morning too. It uh, held the trucks up to about 8.30. It was probably 9.30 or so, I believe, before we uh, brought a truck in here and loaded it. Was just, it was just too wet to, to try to mess with it or anything. all these put them on there we'll see what it looks like take about tomorrow we'll get or they'll get a rhythm going and get some uh, get a pile started it starting off on the job from the zero, actual zero like that what it went like it was this morning it takes a little bit to kind of get get going and get rolling
still gonna need about three thousand even once I put these two on and they're small. Poles, I'm talking about utility bowls, the one that you see along the side of the road that holds up the power lines. That's what those will be. Derek's right over cutting. Well, I'm going to go ahead and stop this camera before this video gets too long. I'm not sure how long it's been running, but uh, appreciate y'all watching. And uh, in the new year here. Got a bunch of different things evolving in my world. So, good things too. I'll catch y'all later. Later, taters. <laughs>